Uh, good morning to all of you present here. Now imagine you get to appear for an exam, where and after you clear, you get a number. That number, when recruiters look for, puts you among the top professionals who acquire that particular skill. This particular exam I'm talking about is the Autodesk Professional Certified Examination, where it gives you an opportunity to be in the league of professionals which are recognized globally. Now, once a student that we have has appeared for two examinations and cleared them with flying colors, may I request, without wasting much of your time, Vimash, to come forward and accept his certificates and share his experience with the exam. I recently in the month of December gave my exam orders and Revit. Now with the exam I had a particular expectation with it and I I am pleasantly to say that it was a very difficult exam. But not for the reasons I believe it to be. If you have any experience with the software, any experience at all, if you have studied for it, if you have practiced for it, you will see that you will understand what the exam is about. But the main difficulty comes into questions. The questions are tricky to say the least. You will spend most of the time reading the question, understanding it, and then solving some. And in the exam itself, time is the biggest problem. While for that you might not have an issue with time, Revit, on the other hand, will eat up your time. For the first, for my first attempt, which I gave on my exams, I actually had no time left for checking my Revit paper. I literally had what finished it in the last few seconds. seconds. Now, uh, don't be uh, scared. You have technically, if you score well enough for a first attempt, you get a second attempt. And I'll be honest, I did not clear my first film. It was a very difficult exam. Now, now, second attempt, you know the paper, you know the pattern, you know all of how it's going to be operated. So now you can go and you can save a lot of time with how the questions are. You can solve the paper. Now for preparation for the exam, I just suggest to just practice on the software. The more practice you get, the faster you can complete your steps, faster you can solve the answers, and faster you can just get the answer to the paper. And I also suggest that you keep some time for checking your answers. The papers are very finicky on the specific mark. For example, if you take an area or a dimensioning, even if you get a decimal wrong, you lose those marks. And every single question will count for a lot of marks. So, if you ever do appear for exam, take your time, but obviously do not take too much time because there's not much of time. <laughs> but read the questions, get enough practice with the software to be very comfortable with it. And just remember, every minute counts. And uh, please felicitate Rimash with his certificates for AutoCAD and Revit. Thank you.